Treat is sponsored by Syracuse University. Syracuse University is looking to help entrepreneurs here in central New York by hosting not one but two competitions with some pretty big cash prizes. That's right. One competition is for current SU students, but the other is actually for students throughout central New York. And here to tell us about all those opportunities, our program manager at SU's Blackstone Launchpad. Braden Croy, and two SU student entrepreneurs, Lawrence Lynn and Tay Lottie. Good morning to you all. Good morning. Good morning. morning. Thanks so much for joining us. And, you Absolutely. know, Braden, tell us a little bit about this sort of dual competition yeah. here, if you will, and if you can explain the two. Absolutely. So it's two competitions. One application is the way I like to tell it to <laughs> students. SU students are competing in the RVDI Prize, which is very generously made possible through um, the School of Information Studies. Dean Liz Liddy there has done fantastic in pulling her, her advisory board together to create a fund for entrepreneurship, the RVD fund. And this is a $40,000 business plan competition for SU students, grad, undergrad, um, whether they're in the idea stage or in the venture growth stage. A great opportunity for them to get some exposure and get some of that pre-seed funding that we hear a lot um, from students that that's what they need. And then Compete CNY is the regional semifinals of the New York State Business Plan Competition. It's in its seventh year um, this year, and they will be competing for $100,000 at the New York State Finals in Albany. But that's open to any Central New York student in the five-county region. So it's Onondaga County, Oswego County, Madison County, Cayuga County, and Cortland County. Okay. And you brought a couple of students who have got some great ideas. <laughs> Take, tell me about Presently. Yeah, so my venture is Presently, and Presently was kind of born from the simple realization that the process of gift giving is difficult and we kind of empathize with that problem at presently and so we got, went ahead and designed a group gift giving service and our service generates memorable gifts for memorable people without breaking the bank. Mm, all right. And Lawrence, your uh, idea, Savo Fair, right? Yep. Uh, as an idea I wish I had when I was a college <laughs> student. Tell us a little bit about it. So, SavoFair.com is an online platform where we connect student travelers with local students during their planning stage of their trip uh, so that they can have local advice and tips from locals who know the city well. Mm. Uh, this is to solve the problem where students don't want to go to a new city. Uh, and, and see touristy stuff. They want to see the local and authentic experience, and that's what we're trying to achieve by connecting students together through our platform. Mm, okay. Braden, how do people get involved in these competitions? So they can go to competecny.com. There's an application the form that they have to fill out. They have to be current students or graduated in December of 2016. Okay. So if they have recently graduated, they can still compete. And then they fill out the application, and March 24th is when the competition is being held at SU. Mm -hmm. It'll be a five-minute pitch followed by five minutes of Q&A from local judges who are entrepreneurs, investors, um, and, and community members in the entrepreneurship scene. Wow. Now, for you both, Tay, um, what is the takeaway or what are you doing, what are your next steps now as you move forward? Yeah, so with Presently, we're still in the development stages of our idea. So a reason why we're competing at RVD is to kind of just get some more funding for operational, just kind of more business development in order to further pressure test our idea and just kind of grow our small customer base as it is now. Um, and just kind of simple marketing expenses is kind of what we're looking for from that competition. So it's a great opportunity to get that. And what about for you, Lawrence? So currently we're on our beta test. We've been beta testing for a few months and we're launching in on April 14th. Uh, so the platform can be used by uh, all the student travelers who are traveling for the summer. Uh, and of course we'll be competing in the RDI price because um, uh, it, it's always good to bootstrap your, um, your, 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 your startup and, and it's, it's a great opportunity to, um, to use this, this competition as, 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 a, as a way to generate some, some funding for a startup. Fantastic. If you'd like so to learn more about it, if you'd like to <laughs> learn more about it, you can go online to launchpad.syr.edu and get all the details. Thank yes. you all Thank so much. Thank you so much. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. And we'll be right back with Joe Stanley. Stay with us.